We're introducing a new product called the C-Box, the first of which is our HDSDI splitter. It converts one 3G SDI signal into four independent reclocked and rebuffered signals. It comes in three variations. The first is a V-mount sandwich, which has a male and female version of the V-mount plate on each side. And this will sit between your battery plate and your battery. So you can snap this on, snap your battery on, and it gets the power from the battery directly. The second here is the same concept with the gold mount. So this will sit between your gold mount battery and your existing gold mount plate. And the third version is an independent plate which has a four pin mini XLR input. And in this version, we include a DTAP to mini four pin XLR cable, as well as an AC adapter. Now this converter box has the whole patterns for V-mount, gold mount, and red blue shape battery plates. This will fit in between your existing battery plate and wherever you have it mounted currently. And we'll show you that now. Now here we have the quick back, which has the whole patterns for V-mount and gold mount style plates. And we can attach the C-box directly. First, take your Allen wrench and loosen the four screws on the back. Now once those are loose, you can separate the main portion from the back cover plate. Now this back cover plate will attach directly to the quick back. Use your included flathead M3 screws and align them with the hole pattern on the back of the quick back. Now that that's tight, we'll take the main body portion and attach it back to the back plate. Now that that's tight, we're ready to add our V-mount plate. Now that that's tight, we're ready to attach our DTAP cable. First, plug in the mini XLR, then loop it around and plug into the DTAP. Now that this is all set up, you're ready to attach your battery to power the camera and the C-Box. Now that everything is set up, you can see how the C-Box interacts with the camera. It takes the power from the V-mount plate, and it takes the BNC HDSDI signal from the back of the camera and distributes it to two external monitors, both the small HD on the side here, as well as the Alphatron EVF on this side. There are two additional ports which you can use for video village or recording an external HDSDI signal. These products are all available in our store now.